Hi everyone. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I will walk you through the step by step process of installing Ubuntu in VirtualBox. By the end, you will have a fully functional Ubuntu system running on your computer inside the VirtualBox. So let's get started. So in our first step, we will firstly download the VirtualBox package to the our host operating system. So navigate to the virtualbox.org website and click on download button. Here you can see different operating system VirtualBox packages. I am using Windows host so I will download VirtualBox Windows host package. In this tutorial, I have already downloaded VirtualBox package and installed in my Windows host. So I don't show you how to install VirtualBox in this video. So I want you to download and install VirtualBox in your host operating system. Now our second step is download Ubuntu ISO from the official Ubuntu website. So navigate to ubuntu.com, click on download Ubuntu button. Here you can see download Ubuntu desktop. This is a Ubuntu latest version. So I will download this Ubuntu latest version. However, I have already downloaded the Ubuntu ISO. So you need to download Ubuntu ISO from here. Now our next third step is to create a virtual machine so simply click on machine click on next so here you can see new window is open assign name your virtual machine so here I am assigning name is Ubuntu this path is default so don't change it now select ISO image from here select I have downloaded the ISO select ISO now click on skip unattended installation click on next so here you can see new window is open so here we are assign RAM size how much CPU processor we are using. So I will assign 4 GB to this Ubuntu virtual machine. If you don't have sufficient RAM in your host machine, so you can assign 2 GB as well. But recommended is 4 GB. And processor is I am assigning 2. Now click on next. So here you can see create a virtual hard disk now. So by default it is taking 25 GB but if your requirement is more so you can select more size. My requirement is around 80 GB so I am assigning 80 GB hard disk size. So don't click this pre-allocate full size keep as it is dynamically allocated virtual hard disk click on next so you can here you can see summary of your virtual machine base memory is 4 GB processor 2 disk size is 82 GB now click on finish so here you can see Ubuntu virtual machine is appeared here now right click on your Ubuntu virtual machine click on settings here you can see basic details of your virtual machine 
here you can see display section video memory is showing 16 MB so keep it in 28 MB click on OK in next step we will start this Ubuntu virtual machine to begin the installation so here you can start this virtual machine from here click on start see these three options we are going to install Ubuntu in VirtualBox so we will select first option install Ubuntu so simply select and enter See here, you have to choose some basic details to configure your Ubuntu. So I am selecting English. Next. Click on Next. Keyboard layout, I am choosing as it is. Click on Next. So here I am not using to connect internet I'll choose do not connect to the internet option click on next and skip it for now I'll choose install Ubuntu as we are installing Ubuntu in our virtual box click on next click on next here I am choosing default selection because this utility required some more time so as per requirement I will install later this software so choosing default selection click on next I'm not choosing anything here click on next so I will select it is disk and install Ubuntu select next here you have to assign your system name username and password so I'm assigning name here I am choosing some weak password you, you should use a strong password click on next select your time zone click on next install this process takes 
few minutes so don't worry it will take some time as per your host system configuration so don't worry now see installation process is completed it is asking for restart the machine so we will simply restart it will take few minutes to get up see login window is appeared we will now log into the ubuntu machine using our password that we have said during the installation click enter desktop is appeared see welcome note is also appeared now we will update and upgrade our ubuntu system by opening terminal so simply control edit t shortcuts control alt t shortcut opens a command line terminal using the update and upgrade command we will update installer packages software with latest version so click enter after typing this command click enter so this will ask password see ubuntu is updated and upgraded successfully now our ubuntu is running inside virtual box if you found this tutorial helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe thanks for watching